like some of you, I was raised in a small Midwest town, isolated from big cities, no idea what a Unitarian Universalist was because there were no congregations anywhere in our area, at least that I knew of. Homogeny ruled. People even had the same haircut. When I went back with a crew cut years later, I was quite the curiosity walking down the street. And heterosexuality was just an expectation. So my family gave a huge collective sigh of relief when I married a white man. And that lovely friend was the one who had no issues at all with my queerness. He really got that me being bisexual was clearly an expression of my theology. And that, um, which is basically to love people's souls, not the shell that they're born into. And when Tom and I moved away to the Northwest to raise kids to love whomever they choose, we would show up at pride parades and Tom had this great shirt that said, I'm not queer, but my wife is. And we would have our kids in um, little outfits with gender signs all over them, kind of scattered throughout with question marks. And we really thought if there's going to be a gay child born in the world, it's going to end up being in our family. We just know that. And the irony was, years later, fast forward, here I am now, divorced, dating a wonderful woman who my boys adore. And both boys identify as heterosexual. And I love this for right now. They say we're heterosexual now, but you know, life is long and who knows. I love that. That was so not even a part of my thinking, part of my vocabulary, any of that growing up. I learn a lot from my, my boys. I was recently on a staff team uh, so blessed to be a part of the Unitarian Universalist Association's Office of Youth and Young Adult Ministries. And the very first thing that we did as a staff team is we made a video. We got together and made a video for the It Gets Better campaign. I don't know if you've heard of this campaign before, but if you do a, a search online for It Gets Better, and you may want to add the word video, up will pop a whole myriad of videos with basically the message, you are whole, holy, and precious, just as you are, and that while you're probably struggling wherever you are right now, especially as a teen, maybe being bullied for being gay, lesbian, transgendered, questioning, gender questioning, that as you get older, it gets better. So we made this video, and my boys were wildly proud of it. And they're sending it out to their friends or posting it on Facebook. And it felt really good. They were like, Mom, you're a rock star. And I remember picking up Owen from basketball practice. And in comes a bunch of the guys from the basketball team, really tall guys, big muscles. They get in the car and they're like, Miss Tandy, we saw the video. It's really awesome. Good for you. We're so proud of you. And then one of them said... <laughs> And Miss Tandy, if anybody gives you any problems, you let us know. And that ba basketball team, we're going to take care of them. And it stunned me. I sat there so surprised. Because all this time, all this time I do gay rights work, I'm thinking I'm being an advocate for my own children. And here, they and their friends are being advocates for me, as if I needed somebody to stand up for me. And I just let that wash over because I think, how would my life be different if I had had a group of friends like my own kids and their friends to stand up for me in those times when I didn't know? I just want that for everyone. And so that's where I think of evolution as this graceful redemption. It does get better. It gets better in our families. It gets better in our communities. I am so grateful for finding a Unitarian Universalist home, religious community, that helps me raise my kids and myself. Recently, my son Quinn took me out for a walk. He knew I had been really struggling with introducing my partner, my girlfriend, to my mother. I was so nervous. And Quinn put his arm around me 
And he said, Mom, I understand why you moved out to the Northwest so that you could raise us to be much more open in the world and much more loving in the world. And you've been strong advocates for us to be who we are. He said, all that gay rights work that you have done your entire life, maybe it was for you. Let me know how I can be an advocate. And for me, that is the redemption of evolution. And it's a, it's a total example of how Unitarian Universalism is a liberating community. And I think the best place to raise our families and ourselves. Happy coming out day.